everybody we are here continuing our cyberpunk daily episodes we are currently on episode five any of you are for some reason watching this at a later time that is not actually being streamed do keep in mind that there might be some spoilers ahead as as i'm essentially playing the full game i'm just doing it uh probably like for an hour or so daily um an hour at a time each day i would say on weekends of course it might be a little bit more than that but anyhow we are here ready to get started let me just pull up my stream on my ipad that way i can see if anybody pops in and we can get this rocking um pretty much just a little backstory on what happened previously uh this dude that looks like rick ross pretty much betrayed us even though we had the chance to betray him twice we didn't take this chance um but he ended up taking the chance to betray us his reasoning was that something like pretty much like he doesn't like to work with like people that attract too much attention but this dude looks like rick ross like what it doesn't make sense anyways we're gonna jump right into it right now we are playing as this dude that looks like kane it's actually is kane i was told but anyways i'm gonna get started there. and if anything is too low or too high let me know right now we have to see if we can find this guy like, I, I can't believe Rick Ross really betrayed me, though, to be quite honest with you guys. I should have betrayed him, because if I betrayed him, I would have had 50-50 on the splits. I think that because... I feel like because I didn't betray him, I won't get any. By the way, do you guys like mobile games? I was like, yo, he doesn't have a red. Oh, yo, this gun is nice. All right, we're going to do this in a cool way. Let me check upstairs. Wait, where are you right now? Question mark. Sorry, guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Did you have to go back to work? Question mark. All right, so let's continue. Let me just explore here. Oh, felt it's everything is like different color now. What were they shooting at? Yo, get out of my way! What the hell? Did you see that? Yo, this I forgot his name. But he, he looks like the guy from from that show. Anyways, guys, I do apologize if I'm looking to the left. It's because I am trying to see uh, if anybody pops in. I don't want to miss you guys, so... Gotta make sure. But you, did you guys see that, though? Like, look at this. Every time I hit him... Oh, man, that's nasty. Like, in a good way. Brigido 2. Bomb's name is what? So, right now... I'm so I get out of there. A shotgun elites. Wow. Ah, we gotta get out of here, lady. We gotta get out of here. Am I going downstairs or upstairs? This was locked before. Yeah. I mean, it's still locked. Lady, don't we have to go? Or was I going the wrong way? Oh. That was weird. You wouldn't understand. That's funny. Alright, so I'm supposed to go do something. Yo, there's like I'm supposed to go here, aren't I? I guess I'm gonna find access point to the network. Okay, so I gotta go back down, I guess. I'm playing as Kane at the moment. He does a. Oh shit. I won't even let us go there. I was like, yo, I'm about to jump down. Yo, watch this, watch this. Okay, so when I hit them with the Q, the melee, it throws fire at the same time. That's, that's a beast mode. Dude, 
Dude, he has so much health. Like, he has armor and health. Like, I can legit go here and melee this guy. Oh, no, I can't. No, I can't. I mistook his yellow bar for, like, armor. Because I don't... Normally, you don't have that yellow bar on the left side. So, for some reason, I was like, well, I've never seen that before. So, maybe it's armor? But, no, it's because since I'm playing him, I guess the... Eh, it looks different. Or maybe it's just my settings here. I mean, my settings are normal. As far as the RPG element of it goes. Alright, so we gotta head back down. I wonder if we'll get to play him, like, multiple times. Yo, this gun does too much damage. It's one, one shot headshot. And then he lights them up every time he millies them. So obviously since I'm playing him, I don't really have a huge reason or any reason to explore. Because I can't loot anything anyways. Yeah, I can't even loot bodies. So this is just like one of the extra things. Yo, his gun is nasty though. I just realized because I am playing him, I also don't get any health packs. Yo. Yo, my, my handgun does more damage than his freaking shotgun. Like, yo, what? I mean, I'm not, I guess I shouldn't be complaining about that. Closing in on the access point. Pretty much hacking this. They thought we were doing it to fight Corpo, but we actually were doing it for this dude's groupies or something. At least, that's what they said. Also, I kind of want to... Not right now, but like once we finish the first playthrough and you know, I'll probably play some other games here and there But I will come back to this one and I uh, at that point once I already beat it once I want to go back and beat a corpo instead Oh god So obviously they're gonna come for us because that's pretty they're talking about us essentially issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the So situation. we're still uploading this. Now get out of there. All right, now we got to get the hell out. Hit the roof quick. Yeah, we went all the way down. Now we got to run back to the freaking roof. Let's go. Oh. Shit. Oh. Oh no, what is this guy? Shit. That's Adam Smasher. I guess this is technically my first boss. Johnny, hey, welcome to the stream, brother. How you sir day going? I, I thought that was going to be my best my first boss. How the hell did we end up here? That's that's I guess something to explain later. All right, so we escaped that guy. So I guess I'm pretty sure he will be one of the my first boss that I fight. I don't know that for a fact though, because I'm still new to it. Oh snap! Oh snap! Wait, does this dude named Reeves die? Told you, Johnny boy. Told you I'd end you someday. Oh damn! You know it's wild too, like. His band people or whatever were telling him not to do this be for this same reason. I maybe they jinxed it. I don't know. By the way, if uh, you have been seeing my previous streams and stuff, you'll know that I called this one dude Rick Ross, and if you guys see him, you'll know who he is. But he betrayed us pretty much, and that's why we're doing all this right now. I was, I'm pretty much like, I guess, I, I can't, is it Reeves or Reeves? I don't know. Let us try once more. You associate. Who are they? How did you acquire a pistol material? Give your buddy a chance to speak. Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <laughs> like, nope. Wait. They blew up his. They blew off his arm, though. Like he still has it, unless they attach a different one. Unless, unless. 
Yeah, guys, if I'm looking to the left, it's just to see the chat and stuff. I didn't get a chance to respond, dang it. Oh well. Is he gonna like recruit me and send me on a mission? I feel like that's what he's gonna try to do. Hot damn. Done and gone. I can't do O's today. Wait, who is this girl? Yo, I like her shades. That's nice glasses. I want some like that round. Kind of sweet. Why did you do this? Bring an end to the madness, freak. Damn, I guess I pissed this guy off. What the hell are they doing with this machine? I guess they're gonna make me experience something I don't want to experience. Like in the game, boys. Mm. We're in the Matrix. Approach a stranger. Stranger, where are you going? I gotta approach you, dude. Is that myself? I think it is. At least I can alternate me. Yeah, it's a little bit trippy. Like, imagine being high as hell and like playing this part. It's me. Yeah, see, I told you guys, it's me. And you, who are you? Who are you? Oh shit! Rick Ross betrayed me. So did I meet him in that simulation world? I feel like. The guy that this dude was talking to was the character I use, but I could be wrong. Because freaking Rick Ross killed me and I can't wait to get him. Hey, welcome back, brother. We're here continuing on episode, I think we're on five or six. I forgot. I think six. We just played as your favorite character. I forget his name, though. Pretty much, he went to the tower to go, um, go plant something for his fans or groupies. I don't know. That's, it says something like that. He didn't say it, but this other lady I was with said it. Oh, 2077. Wait, so what was the year that we started at? I'm curious. I'm going to search that up. What year does Cyberpunk start at? Because it said 2077, and I feel like I've probably been in this crapyard for quite some time now as I crawl I'm gonna look it up originally a role-playing game like Dungeons and Dragons so so I think cyberpunk might start the game had a full review in 2018 I'm still crawling. Oh, it's fucking Rick Ross, bro. He's the one that sent me here. Unless he he did it as a thing. Oh, there's one of those bots again. Yeah, unless he did it on purpose. I don't know. He has something up his sleeve. Because he freaking shot us yesterday, remember? Ugh, heavier than he looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So oh. Oh snap! 
Rick Ross. So Rick Ross was being controlled by this guy. Holy shit. I would have never guessed. He almost looks like Bautista. I'm gonna say fuck. He probably would have smacked me anyways. That's wild, man. Like, that's... That's pretty cool that they did that because, like, the game kind of, so far, like, keeps you on your toes. Like, Rick Ross betrayed me, and I thought he did it because he was trying to keep all the cash for the item we acquired. But it turns out that this dude was, like, controlling him the whole time. I like that, you know? I guess unexpected. And obviously, this guy's gonna help me, and I might meet Reeves. I think that's his last name. I might end up meeting Reeves. Most likely. Use the air. Oh. Shit. So it appears like... The character we're playing as is like really wanted or unless it's a rick ross boys oh, i gotta destroy the motorcycle i can't do anything to them i don't even have health here though <laughs> excuse me Oh, I wasted that slow motion, dang it. I probably get hit him in the face. Although I can't even kill him though, I have to destroy the motorcycle. Because if I shoot him, it doesn't really do anything. Oh, that car looked nice on the left. Oh, la muerte. Oh, you, I won those blades. That's like, um, what is that dude from... Mortal Kombat called, I forgot his name, Baraka? Like Baraka Blades. Probably saying that wrong too though. Well damn. Yo, it's so hard to shoot. Like what the hell? Oh snap, that hurt. That was harsh. You know, I know I've said this before, but I feel like the future could be similar to this in a way. Keep your eye open. Fuck. Finish him up. <sighs> welcome, welcome back, brother. I may just get to cut to the chase. He doesn't need to know that I remember him. Which I don't remember him, but obviously the char our character in the game does. Oh, Victor's a dude I always go to for upgrades. Or I'm supposed to go to for upgrades. You know, for somebody that's hurting really badly, this guy doesn't look in bad shape. He sounds in bad shape. Not my guy, but this guy in front of us. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's a service I would like. 
I guess that's kind of like Uber though in a way. But it's more personalized for the person. <laughs> He'll die either way, so I might as well try something. Now proceed to connect. Yeah, everything went dark. I cannot hold it. He's in bad shape too. I need to rest. Dang, is he gonna die too? They definitely added some good plot twists in this game. So far, it's not bad. It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the accident. Welcome, Bing Cortana. Seen you around a couple times. I know what I'm doing. Alright. So we're back at Vic, so we know we're safe at least. But see, you know what I don't get? If that dude had Rick Ross betray me, and then he was gonna betray Rick Ross to get me, then why would you go through all that trouble? <laughs> you know, like uh, that's what makes no sense. I guess I can get up if I press W. No, never mind. Yeah, like I don't get that, like that makes no sense. He said every day, so obviously, <clears throat> so obviously we can assume we've been here for probably at least a week, laying in bed. B, you in there? Victor's clinic. <laughs> I won't say fuck again, I'll just go to it. Here's a ring. But I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. You know what's wild? Like in the future that things are like this? loud. Like it's like really cool to us, you know, but like I almost can't breathe. I guess what I'm trying to say is like you see how he sees stuff and stuff? Like for them it's probably a little bit more normal. But they still get like scared by it. Even though they're like pretty much androids in a way. not to laugh I plan a bomb in our socket tower nothing there to laugh about hmm you know so pretty much the character we're playing as experience Keenus Reeves I, I honestly forget his name but you know who I'm talking about um the dude from the 100 that looked like um night city look different the look-alike, the dude that's name is Kane in the 100. Um, so I guess we were, hated everybody. we were experiencing Every that, inch. but it was actually the character we play. It was too real. Kind of trippy. Even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, B. I guess that's why when we went into the Matrix, there's a personality construct on that. That's why we saw him. Dreams you had, were from his past. Huh. Saying I experienced another psyche's memories? How's that possible? You two are connected in a way I can't make head or tail of. Oh. Who? Me and who, Vic? Johnny is his name Who's here, I think. Other? Johnny Silverhand, the terrorist. Real talk of the town back in my day. Oh, so I guess my character is supposed to be much younger. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. I've seen you scared. 
Let's say this. I want to see if he gives me some good answers. What is it? You uh, don't got a lot of time left, kid. Hey, what now? I like how he's actually wearing like you know. It's basically a well, actually, it's just a shirt. I thought it was like like a nurse. Construct is overriding your consciousness, gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. It's kind of wild, don't you think? Like, damn. B, it's important you get all this. It picks me up, right? Vic, if I could, I would be. Believe me, but this is. Way beyond what so I I'm being overrided by the, best of the, best the Reeves. Why can't you help me? That's that's interesting. You want the long story or the short? Uh, I mean, uh, I guess I just I go short. Die. I am going to die. That's what you're saying. Prove it. How is he gonna prove it though? Deck shot you, right? The bullet damaged your chip slot and your brain. The biochip revived and short circuited you. It started uploading data into your head. As far as it was concerned, your brain was an empty vessel uh... that needed to be filled by the engram it was carrying. Empty vessel? But I'm right here. All of this is me. The shark Damn. doesn't read, it writes. Headache of yours is the biochip rewiring your neural pathway. That's trippy though. Neural structures. Kind of interesting. The old. From where the shark's sitting, you, what's left, is all a tumor that needs to be excised. Mm. Vic. You've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? I don't even think he has the answers to that. Please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Damn, that Miss sucks. Me? I imagine that. Spunky monkey. Yeah, that'd be a cool sign to have, like, somewhere in this back over here. I might actually look that up and buy it probably. Come on, V. Let's get you home. Damn, like imagine if somebody told you like, yo, you have like one or two weeks left. Like what would you do, you know? Like, what would you do at that point? I feel like I would want to travel, but at the same time, I don't know. You know? Uh with him in my sleep. Small hint of death, the inevitable. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Can't actually tell if I'm Sleep is a small now. hint of death. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here, got some meds for you. What you got for me? Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also. They should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. So it's like I have from me. technically because the other dude's Best being uploaded technically to up. this body, then Bring we're both demon, so kind of here. But it's still more of the character we play than it is the Reeves. For me, I affect the opposite. Of this it'll speed things up, free the demon, so to speak. Also, it's pretty much she's giving me the option to either. Okay, take the blue pill, which is technically, I guess it was orange and blue, right? Or, but we just say red and blue. I can't remember the models, but yeah, she's pretty much saying like, if you want to live a little longer, take this. If you want to die faster, take this. Which is kind of nice. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm. Oh, the bullet. Promise you'll try to get some sleep. Oh, Jackie is dead. I want to I wanna compliment her, but at the same time, it's like... 
what happened to Jackie? Like last time we saw him, he was dead. Yo, she does. No lie, bro. Thanks, Lee. Wait. Uh, about Jackie. Oh, how come they doesn't let you emote? But yeah, um, that's crazy. She does like the bride of Chucky. Or are you talking about the lady or the actual doll? The lady, right? Although she kind of does look like the doll in a way. I'm so fucking sorry Jack's not here anymore. Jackie was special. Yeah. Really spiritually rich. I feel like they took a lot of... Because, you know, there's so Rick Ross. Well, the other guy is obviously him playing himself. Don't worry. But I think they take little hints from stuff. That we already like have enjoyed at uh, some or enjoyed or hated. Life I don't know. So beautifully powerful. So much more. Oh, look at that mask. Death. Hey, we got that cat. But right now you need rest. So sleep. Please sleep. Oh, damn. They have a lot. They actually added a lot of people. And I think that's awesome because it adds more like attraction to the game like you know like if you're a big fan of either of these people then you're gonna want to show up you're gonna want to try it at least so it looks like we're sleeping now Do you need notifications? Gotta get out of oh, see that guy. So he's trying to get uploaded Kill onto my body. My you Damn. So he's actually a bad guy. I didn't know that. I guess the body I'm using is more compatible with him. So it's really compatible with whatever his is. So... You know, he wants this. It's kind of like if you've seen like Lucifer and stuff like that, those shows. It's like they can on only enter specific vessels. How did you get here? I don't smoke. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, wait. I thought it said smoke. Where did even come from? How are we even talking? How the fuck should I know? Wait, so the voice is actually himself? Go he keeps smacking his face. That's pretty cool. Who you work for? Start talking. Fuck. Oh, he can actually feel him too. That's wild. Fuck. Oh, he's con. I mean, it's it's him. Obviously, like they're both being or not both. He's being downloaded onto our body. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No wait. Hmm. Oh. It's a lot of cutscenes though, but I guess that's kind of good too. Kind of like a movie or a TV show. I'll take control. Mac and Jesus. <laughs> Mac and Jesus. I'll find a way. You hey. hear me? Hmm. Like I'm sure there's people that actually feel that way, you know? No, I I've seen it, but I actually never got the chance to play it sadly. Excuse me. Touch on you. I'm like I'm mold like on fruit, fruit creeping, creeping into you. you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? Oh, so he has no choice either? I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Like, it's still... He's still responding as if it was actually him, and it probably is. But... So it's just randomly being uploaded onto our body. Yeah, I should try it, honestly. Oh, damn, four hours? 
I mean, oh, it says to crawl. My bad. I was like, I, I was waiting for something to happen. Um. Kill you. Do it. What are you waiting for? I mean, yeah, like I think that may be good. Some people like that. Some people don't. I think it's kind of cool though because at the same time, it's kind of like it makes it kind of like a TV show if you actually sit there and watch it. So pretty much, I don't know if uh. No, so pretty much you remember how Rick Ross shot me? So after Rick Ross shot me, I went to the junkyard, I suppose. And I don't know exactly how their bodies work, but pretty much the, I guess the AI in their bodies or whatever it is, I don't know if it's even an AI, but it pretty much read that there was nobody in that body. There was no host in the body. So it was trying to upload somebody else's, I guess we can call it consciousness, into this body. But then the character we play as woke up, but it woke up at the same time that the other body was slowly being like uh, downloaded onto this body, if that makes any sense. And like uh, that one Victor said, pretty much now that, what is it called? Let me go check something. So big, like Victor said, pretty much there's nothing I can do at this point. I mean, I'm pretty much, yeah, pretty much fucked. But he also did say something else that I wanted to point out, but I completely forgot. Oh, like, oh yeah, he, what Victor said was that, um, pretty much, the A we can, we'll just call it an AI, just for the sake of making the conversation, uh, easier. Um, so pretty much the AI thinks that even though our character is back alive, the AI still thinks that that's just something left over, like maybe memories or something. Uh, cause they, like he said, the AI doesn't actually read. Why would I do that? It doesn't read, it only writes. So it doesn't actually acknowledge the fact that I'm actually still here. It just remembers that I died and then it, the host, the body was free. And for some reason it picked that dude's body. Is it is trippy though. Okay, I'm about to jump off. Oh, I died. Dang it. Oh, wow. So I live, but I die when I hit that. That was BS. Like, how didn't I die, like, on the first high jump? Oh, well. Okay, I'm not going to jump anymore. Okay, so let's sell some stuff real quick if it'll let me I'm just gonna sell all of this. I don't really have use for any of that And I'll, I'll make it quick. I won't I'm not actually gonna sit here looking at what I want to sell and what I don't I'm just gonna sell what whatever has a uh, red arrow The only thing I won't sell with a red arrow is probably that Oh, you know what? I didn't realize I had that gun. Sorry. Yeah, I don't have any clothes. What the fuck? Yo, it's crazy how they actually allow like all of that, you know? Okay, so at least let me put something on, I guess. I didn't even know I, I had nothing on. Oh. What is that? Put that on. That looks kind of nice. I won't spend too much time here either. I'm just going to go through it quickly. The main thing I wanted to do was, well, that's what I want. And that. And we're good to go. Okay. Why would I do that? Uh, yeah, let's go. Why would I do that? Doesn't that look like an alien? Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Yeah, he's the one that saved our life, but at the same time, he's the one that had Rick Ross betray us. Because Rick Ross was telling him, like... Okay, so obviously I went through the wrong stairs. Let me go back up. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Okay, no, the freaking yellow arrow is here. Hey, Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. But 
Okay, I'm sorry, I'm tripping. Okay, I'm supposed to go down. <laughs> but I thought we tried going down already. Okay, I didn't do this. Barry, we know you're in there. We're here to help. Don't got no fucking warrant. All right, let's see what's going on here first. Cut the bullshit. Just don't read the message from the we came here mystery. As Polly. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. We're worried. No. <laughs> They're worried, all right. Congrats, Mendez. Way to be a prick. Oh, what? So I'm the bad guy? I'm not the one you hold on to. Oh, that was just. Oh, I thought I was supposed to watch that for some reason. But what will we do? Yo, can I buy food here? Look how good that looks, yo. I'll take the sushi. The tofu soup looks good. Got some noodle cup. Oh, there's a sword sign here. What have you got for sale? Only top shelf gear. Let's see it then. What is that? Oh, it's just a bat. Yo, he has a hammer. He has a katana. We already have that though. Ours is black unicorn. But well, it's the same general. White knuckle, white knuckle. Alright, yeah, I won't spend too much time there either. I just saw that it was like a sword. So I was like, hell yeah, I, love, I like the swords. Like, this thing is killer, dude. I'll probably kill somebody with it. I'll wait for bad guys, I guess. It hits hard, too. And I upgraded it, so it hits um faster than normal. I actually have some points that I have next pen. While this goes down, we can probably look at our points. Oh, shit. Where is it? You know what? We won't. I'll do that on my own time. I'll, I'll do my, uh, I guess, attributes or I don't know what they're called. I forgot. <laughs> Pretty much when I end the stream, I'll take it a quick second to upgrade those. Because I would actually have to read them and all that. What is this guy? I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to. Yeah, I gotta get away from these people. I'll probably steal a car here. Honestly, you would think that some of the cars here are nice, but you would think that there's like nicer than this. <laughs> but I guess it is what it is. Oh, how do I exit this uh, point of view? Or Yo, this is Forza right here, bro. Oh, can I get in this car? Oh, there's a gang here. Okay, a fixer just sent you an offer to buy a vehicle whenever you receive an offer. A new marker will appear on your mini map to buy the vehicle. Go to the indicated location to confirm your purchase. Oh, that looks nice. If it's that golden one. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Are you guys selling the vehicle? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Yo, yo, chill out, lady. So this is their territory. Um... Yo, what the hell? I don't have any... Uh, I don't have any health. I'm sorry. Everybody's after me now, yo. Oh, what is this? This looks nice. Can I get in this? Yo, this looks sweet. The back is kind of like the DeLorean, but not really, actually. <laughs> Shit, it's too powerful for us, man. I feel like they've already kind of fixed a lot, some of the bugs in the game. I 
I don't know how to change stations. Sorry. <laughs> I know I'm crashing into everything. It's just I'm trying to figure out like how to change stations. But this is not bad music though. I just want to know in general. <laughs> and of course it's like GTA. When you get a nice car and you're driving it, then you find nice cars everywhere. Yeah, that song doesn't sound terrible. That's the first car that actually lifted me up. They all go underneath, usually. Oh, what is that blue marker? I will worry about that later. We'll be doing some side quests. Not today, but like in general. Exploring the game more a little bit. Because it's a... Oh. Oh, oh, there's a bat symbol there. Let's go. It's probably some type of fight. Padre Ibarra. Oh god, no. I was just trying to go to the fight. Like, the city's actually pretty big. It's pretty nice. I mean, then again, similar. GTA is like... What car is that? I do wish that people fall back though. I thought he, we just talked to him. Oh, I need ability for that. Never mind, sorry. I thought I could open it. It doesn't let me know. Yeah, you see how the car just jumped out of nowhere? Like, I probably shouldn't be doing streaming while driving. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Yo, is this car gonna blow up? It's on fire. Hopefully it has more life. Look at that. Oh, that's the police. Never mind. Who? Why do people keep calling? Oh. Oh, there's a gun shop. Okay, we gotta get out. Oh, God. Oh, dude. Damn it. Okay, I'm gonna just go straight to the mission now. I'm gonna stop messing around. I don't know why I was messing around. I'm gonna go straight to this mission, see what they want, and then maybe I'll end it there. I'm kinda tired today, man. I didn't sleep till late last night. I didn't, not on purpose, but this is how it happened. Oh, cool, at least we get our car back. Excuse me. Martin Luther King, oh, we, they're still on fire though. I was kind of happy. I was like, yo, we get our car back on in good shape. So obviously I can't crash into anything or I'm going to blow up. Don't crash into me, dude. Capitan. V. I'm trying not I'm trying so hard not to like crush anything serious. I thought we just talked to El Capitan. Wait, the GPS just changed on us. You you saw that. Oh, my car is kind of jumpy. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, my driving is terrible, man. Oh, sorry, lady. Oh, the car's more on fire. I think we should get out of it. I gotta ditch the car, yo. Oh. 
It's only right that we blow it up. This is not even actual grenades. Okay, let me not do that. Cops are going to be on me. Oh. I really need to say this. What the hell? Ah, well, I can't utilize that because I'm in combat mode. Wait, what the hell? So it's below us. Okay. Okay, so now we have to find stairs to get below. I mean, we can jump, but you, we know that where that's going to go. Okay, so I'm going to go around. Oh, God. Why do I even play video games, bro? <laughs> I'm, like, going to the corner of, like, dead ends. All right, so it said it was below, though. Isn't that weird? Okay, so I'm following the arrow. And then when we get here, it points an arrow down. Or is it these machines? No, I think it's just below us in general. Wait, why can't I jump? I think I just realized you can't jump in this game. Or maybe I'm just not pressing the right button. Normally, space is to jump. And yeah, nobody still fights back. That's something they have to pick. I know. I looked down and I was like, holy cow, I'm dead. Damn. Yo, this guy looks familiar too. I gotta fight you, you fuck. In the flesh. <laughs> Looking at you yeah. taking my wallet. Yo, I'm putting all I got to use. Yeah, bro, the car was like all four tires were on fire. Now I'll show you why. Disarmed oh, damn. <laughs> So, we got a deal? Was that piss out snow dripping down your leg? We got a deal. Oh, wow. 2,900. I mean, I can give him a compliment. It has a fist up. But then he just talked all that nonsense, so I don't know. Okay, whatever it takes to shut your mouth. Yeah, see? <laughs> down to biz, huh? Ain't the only way you're going down. Follow me. Yeah, it won't let me. Oh, if he got military grade leg too, I guess. You ready? Not too scared, are you, buttercups? <laughs> I look forward to it. Like that. You well, like it, you ass beat, huh? Damn, this dude, yo. <laughs> okay, watch him actually get me though. Oh, yo, he was not joking. Like I thought. Took you for a marshmallow. He was not like joking. <laughs> like I'm over here throwing like hella punches. And he only hit me with like three. Damn, yo. Okay, we're going to go again. Oh, we can't even go again. We don't have enough loot. That sucks. Hello. So I guess we can. Red, as you said. Where'd you get it? Just curious. Heard that was a limited series. Wait, where's his rifle? Three hundred manufactured, KGB issue. Well, well. KGB. I see. I got a gun enthusiast on my head. But we ain't here to talk iron. We here to break bones and crack crow. So, you accept my offer or not? Yo, I can't. Oh. It won't even let me click on any of them, actually. It only lets me do these. Maybe, later. Maybe it realizes that I'm not ready. 
I just don't have enough gold, dude. Or eddies, that's what they're called here. I'm supposed to talk to him, though. I don't understand. Maybe later. Talk to the champion of Arroyo. Oh, I guess I'm supposed to, like, beat him. Okay, so I gotta go find cash somehow. Dang it. I took him for granted. I didn't think he was gonna hit that hard. But I guess when he said military grade. Dang it. I wonder if I kill somebody, do I get stuff? Dude, this person is still laying down. I don't know where the hell I'm gonna find loot. Oh, I can probably sell to that guy. Or to her. Okay, I really need to say this. What are you selling? Anything you can see. Oh. Oh. She has wings? Yeah. <laughs> Nice glasses. Okay, I won't spend too much time here, so I'm just gonna sell this. What else can I sell? I'm gonna sell bandage wrappings. I'll sell that. I'll sell that. Oh, that was. Um, do I have enough yet? How much gold do I have? I have eight. I don't even have enough yet. I don't know if I will have enough. That costs ten. I'm just gonna sell a lot of this stuff, especially these. I loot all this because I feel like I'm going to need it eventually, but what can I do? do? Oh, maybe I can do these. These are only worth 10 each. Wow. Okay. This pistol is way too nice to sell. Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to make enough to fight that dude again. I'm a 19. I need like a thousand more. Can I just rob this vendor? <laughs> It's really gonna make me sell everything. I wonder if I sell it to the guy that actually sells weapons, if it'll give me more. Just cause he's like a weapons guy. Let's just finish this, okay? It's not what have you got in stock? Maybe if I sell guns to him. Yeah, so pretty much we're gonna do this, uh fight him. If we can sell something and get enough. And then we can call it a night from there. Damn, it's really gonna make me sell everything, isn't it? Uh, okay, so well all I care about is this gun right here. So I mean what is I 55 82 Okay, fuck it. We'll get them again. I mean, you know, are you sure you want to sell this item? Yeah If I sold the nicer ones, of course, okay, so we're at 22 He's gonna have to start selling shit So that it's currently equipped currently equipped uh i mean yeah i gotta sell it dude i guess so everything just to fight this dude back that sucks oh i have collectibles here i guess cufflinks three. Oh, we got his record look an antique bygone era but there's still no substitute for a sound from authentic vinyl um, stapler can go i don't know where the hell i need a stapler Honestly, I don't know how the what the crafting was going to require me. That's why I didn't want to sell stuff. Because I feel like I'm going to need... Oh, battery low capacity. Increases max charge and charge damage by 10%. That sounds like something good, but... I just got to sell shit. Because I don't want to like sit here debating what to sell and like not show anything. So I'm just going to sell everything. I'm sure I'll be able to make it back somehow. We're almost there. We are at 27, 28. Dang it, I didn't mean to cancel that. Plus, this stuff is the kind of like junk stuff anyways. Oh, I like this though. Like, this is junk, but I kind of like it. So, I'm going to keep it. I highly doubt there's going to be any use for it. We're almost there. We're almost there. Um, I just don't have much things of high value. Damn, look at this vendor. They have 14 stacks. What if we just like steal it? And it sucks because a lot of these things you can't buy back for the same price. Like, look, um, well, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that either. I guess for the more expensive stuff, like if, obviously it's kind of like GameStop, man. Like if you sell them like something for like 50 eddies, they'll resell it to you for like five. 
I mean, no, no, I said that wrong. They'll resell it to you for like 2000 something. Okay, I almost have enough. Damn, I really have <laughs> nothing of substance. Okay, 29. Was it 29 exactly? I don't, I think it was more than 29. So you know what? I'm just going to sell up to like three, three stacks. Okay, so now we have three stacks. We should be good to fight that dude now. Man, I really, it really will suck if I lose again. Though. Like I said, I took him for granted. I didn't think he was going to do that much damage. But he did say he was like military grade, blah, blah, blah. So, should have listened to him. He should just let me use the sword. All right, we're back here, buddy. Whatever it takes to shut your mouth. I'm gonna get you out of the way. All right, this time I have to be extra careful because he really hurts. I think like four of his punches hurt me. I look forward to it. Like that? You like it, yeah, Eddie? Oh my God. Look at that punch. Oh shit. Oh my god, his health is at 99, bro. His health is at 99, even though I was like punching him. I can't rematch. Oh, wait, you know what? I can't rematch him, bro. You know what? For the sake of not like stream me just running around looking for cash, I we can end the stream here. And then I'll run around looking for cash off stream. And I'll, I'm gonna see if I kill somebody. I, I don't wanna have to kill civilians, but maybe I get Eddie's. It'll make a good experiment. Okay, I don't get eddies from people, so that's pointless. No point in killing them. Maybe from a cop. Oh my god, I slice his limbs off. Okay, they don't drop anything anymore. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Alright, so yeah, bro. Uh, definitely, uh, let me just pop in just in case. Yeah, dude, that dude hits hard. Like, his health was at 99%, even though I landed a couple of punches. And how much gold do I have? Or eddies. I keep saying gold. I only have 122. Dude, that sucks. So, yeah. I'll just do that. I'll end the stream here. And then, uh, pretty much... I'll probably stream something else here shortly. But, I'm going to end it here. And, um... Hell yeah, man. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching. Um, I'm probably going to do tomorrow around the same time. Um, but, yeah. I probably will hop on here later. I'm not sure yet. But, anyways. Thank you for stopping by, brother. You're the real MVP. Anyways, thank you so much. Have a good night.